ARDS or ARDS stands for Acute Respiratory Distress Syndrome. It's a condition that is characterized by fluid in the alveoli that causes refractory hypoxemia, decreased lung compliance, and severe oxygen insufficiency. There are both direct and indirect causes of ARDS. In general, the most common causes include pneumonia, aspiration, lung injury, sepsis, shock, drug overdose, and fluid overload. The signs and symptoms of acute respiratory distress syndrome can begin to show within hours or days of the initial onset. Here are some examples. Severe hypoxemia, shortness of breath, muscle weakness and fatigue, cyanosis, tachypnea, and retractions. There are a few criteria that you can look at in order to diagnose ARDS. Here are some examples. You can look at the patient's chest x-ray. You can look at their arterial blood gas results. You can look at their PFT results or pulmonary function tests. And you can use hemodynamic monitoring. The chest radiograph of a patient with ARDS will show bilateral opacities or infiltrates and the image will resemble a ground glass appearance. The patient's ABG results would reveal severe hypoxemia, which is also known as refractory hypoxemia. Their pulmonary measurements would reveal decreased lung volumes and capacities. If you enjoyed this quick overview, we actually have a more detailed guide on this topic on our website. I will drop a link to it right below this video down in the description. And if you want to support the channel, you can do so simply by hitting the like button. I would greatly, greatly appreciate it. And while you're down there, go ahead and click the subscribe button as well because we have a ton of other videos on our channel that I think you will enjoy. That's it for this one. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next video. And as always, breathe easy my friend.